guys, Portal Master 9351 here, and you know how I said we were going to be getting a huge leak coming up pretty soon, just because we always do in July? Well, here it is. Here is the leak that I was talking about. So, this is from a London press event, and so... This image was released, these four images of the character creation panel. Now, you can tell that this is a prototype for multiple reasons. A, you can see here that they are not called by their traditional names. Instead of Bowslinger, it's Archer. Swashbuckler is Dejini. Dervish, uh, or, or uh, blah. Sentinel is Dervish, and Smasher is Barbarian, and actually has a totally different logo altogether. Now, um, the interesting thing is not necessarily this, but it is these images down here, which I'll get to in just a second. Um, so, yeah, let's get on to them. So, we can see, for Bowslingers, we've got this sort of hooded, one-eyed green character. We've got an impish looking character right here, and then we've got Wolfgang, although that is the first Wolfgang's artwork. That is his artwork from Trap Team, or at least it looks to be that way. Also, you can tell that this is drawn because, or at least not final artwork for this character because all the other characters have blue backgrounds that have final artwork. So I think that that kind of points to uh, this, whoa, being an unfinished character. Um, I'll go to the Dervish or the Sentinels next. Here we can see Ember, and here we can see Hood Sickle. So Hood Sickle and Wolfgang are both confirmed to be villains. That's really interesting, and he may be the 11th villain. That might mean Hood Sickle's the 11th villain. And then here we can see Ember, of course, and we can see another female character. Um, some sort of white-haired, red-eyed, looks pretty awesome, actually. Really curious to find out more. For the Dej Blah, for I can't talk this morning. For the Dejini slash Swashbucklers, we can see Bad Juju. What did I tell you? I said Bad Juju would be a Swashbuckler. And I honestly think that this confirms that all Swashbucklers will have this sort of wispy, uh, genie-like tail, especially considering that the prototype name for Swashbuckler was the genie. So, yeah. Um, Bad Juju, of course, and then we see some sort of a new character that kind of has like an Eon-esque helmet. We can also tell that this is drawn uh, just A, by the quality, and B, the backgrounds are different. This is Bad Juju's original artwork, and then this guy, he looks so cool, and I cannot wait to see how he plays and who he is. He is so cool. And that may even be Wildstorm, but I don't think so. The head, I think, looks a little similar, but no, 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 I'm sorry. No, it's not Wildstorm. Forget I even said that. It's definitely not Wildstorm. For the Barbarians or the Smashers, we can see Tri-Tip, and then we can see this new sort of masked character. So, there's that. So this confirms one, two, three, four five, six, seven new characters. Now, this one right here, I'm going to zoom in, looks to be, whoa, ah, I scrolled, didn't mean to scroll, come on, there we go, so this character right here appears to be a life character, just based off the color scheme, and I kind of figured that we would get a Robin Hood-esque life bow slinger from the get-go, this guy right here, I don't see a bow, and honestly, I would have said, how's Wolfgang and Archer, just from this artwork, so I think that he's definitely a bow slinger, and his bow is somewhere, um, it's just kind of interesting, because you can't see it, I think he's a light character, based off the eyes, and just the general color scheme, and he seriously, he does look like an imp, with these horns coming off of him, so, not really sure what he is, but I am fairly positive that he is of the life, or, sorry, the light element, seriously, can't talk. Uh, of course, we have Ember and Hoodsickle over here. We know them. Uh, so, he's going to be a Sentinel. So, I assume he'll maybe have, like, a double-ended, uh, uh, what do, you, what do you call it? Uh, I can't think of what you call his thing. Sickle! That's right! Why can't I think of that? He'll have a double-ended sickle that he can kind of spin around like it's a baton, but, you know, with blades on either side. This character, obviously female, and you would think that she's a fire character, but just based off her color scheme. 
But it would be really weird and really dumb, in my opinion, to have both of the fire characters both be female and both be, you know, the same battle class. The female part isn't really the isn't a problem. It would just be different since we don't usually get that. Uh, not really stupid or anything. Um, it'd just be different. But... I mean, to have them both be of the same battle class is a bit weird. We can sort of see her weapon right here, but I'm not really sh sure if that is her weapon or not. Um, I'm going to go down to the Dejini or the Swashbucklers next. We can see that this is bad juju, of course, and I, I assume she'll just have double swords. I assume all of these characters will have double swords or double weapons of some sort. Here we can assume that this character is air. She just seems so small to me that air just kind of seems like it'd be the right care the right thing um and plus i assume she's got some sort of a wispy body like you know right down here and that would kind of explain why if you look at her head it's straight up and down but then her body kind of curves around like she's moving forward and her wispy tail or body is kind of lagging behind this character, not Wildstorm. I still don't know why I said Wildstorm to start with. It's definitely not the character that we saw in the trailer. This is a brand new character. Um, I, I think he's Earth. And you may even be able to make out what a, almost looks like an Earth element symbol on there, but I'm not really sure. I think he's Earth, though. It, it's the only thing that really makes sense. Um, and he looks really big and really bulky. And he almost looks like something maybe out of like Norse mythology. So he looks pretty cool, and I'm really excited to actually see what his body is, because he, just looking at that head, does not look like he would have sort of a wispy body or anything. And then here we can see, for the Smashers, we can see what appears to be a new undead character. I can't see it being anything else. The purple eyes, the bony looking head, it's got to be an undead character. So, yeah. Um, and you'll note that there's no other Smasher on here. Peñata is not on there. Now, that's weird. Why is there no Peñata? The general theory is that this is so early on in development, because they had not even gotten the correct symbol or the correct name yet, that Peñata was just not put in there yet. We can already tell that some of this artwork is not finished. Like, Bad Juju and Wolfgang still have their old artwork. This is drawn. This is drawn. Um, and Embers doesn't look final either. That just looks like a really close-up of her toy form, maybe. Um, so, we think that Peñata's just not on there. Now, we could be wrong. Peñata may not actually be a Smasher, but I honestly don't see it any other way, and I do really think that it's just that this is so early on that he's not on there. But, um, anyways, that's all the news I have for you guys today. If I get any more news about this this um you know this leak if we get any more news about anything i will be sure to tell you guys my laptop is fixed now as can be seen the headphone jack is fully working again and i can use the headset again so yeah that's pretty much all for now this has been portal master 9351 check out my social media in the description and remember to like comment subscribe and i'll see you guys next time goodbye